welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Jillian and today as you guys can see from the title it is going to be a clothing haul. So I did recently go out to H&M because the kids needed some more fall and winter clothing and while I was out I did pick up a few items for myself as well. So I would say like 90% of this stuff is for the kids but there is a few things that I bought for myself like I said and then I also have like two things from BB and also under armor which were stuff for me so I'm going to show you guys everything also really quickly I want to apologize about my lighting I don't know what's going on with my phone sometimes the lighting is fine and sometimes it looks like this I just spent probably a good 45 minutes trying to fix it and every time I try to fix it it just looks like this so I kind of gave up on trying to fix the lighting so I do apologize if this lighting is like really orange or just off but just bear with me while I figure this out. I'm going to be getting a new phone. I do film for my phone. So hopefully when I get a new phone, this won't happen anymore. But I'm going to go ahead and jump into this haul because I know I can talk a lot. So like I said, majority of everything is for the kids. But I did pick up a few items for myself. And right now H&M has a really good deal going on. So a lot of this stuff was like buy two, get one free. So like I think the sweaters were buy two, get one free. And also the undershirts were buy two, get one free as well as leggings. So if you guys need new clothes for yourself or your kids, definitely check out H&M. So the first sweatshirt is Madison's and the kids have already started wearing a few of these items. So some of the stuff doesn't have tags, but I got this sweatshirt for Madison and it does have a hoodie. It's super soft um, inside. And I just thought this was really cute. It has some pockets in the front right here. It does say love, but I'm pretty sure my lighting isn't going to let you guys really see that. But it says love right there. And this was a part of the buy two, get one free deal. And Ryan got this sweatshirt, which he also has already started wearing. And it's just a zip up. And then it also has a hoodie, super soft inside. And it's like a blue and white color. So it's white with a bunch of like blue stripes. And he really loves it. So just a simple... um little sweatshirt Madison this really cute shirt and it has these frilly arms with silver stars and a lot of this stuff was super affordable this was only $9.99 so I got her that shirt I also got Madison this sweatshirt so it's like a pullover sweatshirt and this was $9.99 it's like a little kitty cat I thought was really cute and also inside is super super soft i love h&m clothing for kids i used to shop at h&m a lot and recently i just completely forgot about them but they have really good kids clothing kids grow out of clothes so quickly so i don't mind only spending nine dollars on a sweatshirt or five dollars on a shirt because by next year they're just going to grow out of it anyway so i love h&m for kids clothes but i bought her this sweatshirt as well and i found this really cute long sleeve shirt as well and this shirt was $4.99 and it has a little bunny in the front and it's like a um, army green color, not army green color, it's more of like an olive green color, but I thought that was really cute as well. And then I got her some undershirts, but honestly, a few of these shirts, I will just have her wear as basics as well. So this one's like, not turtleneck, I don't know what you would call this, um, but it's not like a full turtleneck, but again, my lighting isn't giving you guys a proper um, picture of it, but this is like a off-white cream color and then it also came with this black one as well and this was in a pack of two these were 14 yeah these were 14.99 but if you bought two you got two free and it, like i said it did come in a pack of two and then i also got her this pack which is like going to be like undershirts but i honestly will probably put it on her as basics as well and this pack was also $14.99 and I think it came with two. So this one is a white long sleeve with black stripes. And then this one is just a solid um, gray color. And like I said, it does come in a pack of two. I also grabbed her these really cute leggings and these were also part of the buy two get one free. And these leggings were $9.99. And it's just like a leopard cheetah print, whatever you guys want to call it. But it's a like heather gray color with dark gray leopard um, print. And it is pretty thick, so it's going to keep her warm. And also inside is super fuzzy. So once it starts getting a little bit cooler out, like for winter, this is definitely going to keep her nice and warm. I picked her up these leggings. These leggings were $9.99. And they are just kind of like a charcoal color, charcoal black color. 
and they are long leggings and they fit her pretty good. My kids have a hard time finding pants. Well, I have a hard time finding my kids pants because their waist is really small, but they're really tall. So if I go a size up, the length is good, but then the waist is too big. So I feel like H&M, um, if you get the skinny jeans, they're perfect for my kids. So if you guys have that problem with your kids, definitely check out H&M. Um, a lot of pants do have that little button inside where you can bring it in. These don't, but these fit her fine. Um, so yeah, just to let you guys know that just in case you guys have a hard time finding your kids' pants as well. So these are a pair of pants that have, this is what I'm talking about. So I know like um, Target and other stores have this, but H&M also has it too. So you can bring in the waist if it's too um, big. So these are a little bit big on her. So I will be bringing it in, but I thought these were so cute. These were... How much were these? These were $20. These are the most expensive pants I think I bought them. But I really liked them because look at the inside. It's really pretty with a bunch of flowers and you roll up the bottom so you guys can see that floral print. So got her these jeans. What else? I also got her this long sleeve like sweater shirt and it's gray with a bunch of white polka dots and this was $12.99. I thought that would go really cute with either jeans or leggings and a cute pair of boots. I also got her this cheetah leopard print shirt and this was $4.99. I think I'm going to bring this one back and go a size up. It fits her fine but it is a little bit short on her so I'll probably exchange this for a larger size but I thought that was really cute with like um some black leggings. She has these white shoes that have like a leopard print on it. I thought it would go really cute with this. So I grabbed her this and the last item I picked up um, for Madison was this pullover sweatshirt. And she loves shirts that have like the sequence where you can feel it. So she's always playing with her shirt that she has. Like this. she has a shirt that's like, I think a heart and she loves it. So again, inside it's super, super soft, super fuzzy and cozy. This was $15 and yeah, it's just a simple black pullover sweatshirt. So everything else is going to be for Ryan. And he didn't need as many like long sleeve shirts as Madison because he still has a few from last year that fit him. But I picked him up this like sweater shirt and this was $12.99. I thought it was really cute. So I grabbed him this one. And then of course I had to get him something with dinosaurs. So I got him this one also like a pullover like sweater shirt and it's gray with a bunch of dinosaurs. And this also was $12.99. And then I also got him... Um, two packs of like undershirts but that he can also wear um as basics so these came in a pack of two and it's just white and like a navy blue and then it also came with this solid blue color as well just basic long sleeve tees and then this one came in a set of three so this one is a lighter gray color this was part of the buy two get one free then a solid black and then this green color so like I said that came in a pack of three and the last shirt I got him was another long sleeve dinosaur shirt it's just white with a bunch of dinosaurs and this was only $4.99 so I grabbed him this and then I did pick him up some jeans so he definitely needed jeans because all his jeans from last year are pretty short on him I'm gonna see if I can go back and pick him up maybe like two more I bought him some from Target so this might be enough, but I don't know. I might go back and get him some more. Oh, these are actually Madison's. I forgot to show you guys. These are $17.99 and these are leggings and it has this sequence heart on both of the knees and they are skinny. So this is the last thing I got from Madison. It was in Ryan's pile, but that was Madison's. I got him these green pants and these I'm going to have to bring back and get a smaller size. On accident, I grabbed a size seven and he needs a um, size six. So I grabbed these, but like I said, I need to go back and get a smaller size, but they're really cute. They're just like a green, simple pair of pants. And then I also got him these, and these are more of like the skinny jeans, and these were $20. And all these jeans do have that drawstring, not drawstring, but the button where you can bring in the waist. So just a simple pair of blue jeans. I also got him these and these are like a really really light gray like charcoal black color not charcoal black more of like a very light gray color but he looks so cute and these knees are skinny and these were $9.99 and the last pair of jeans I got from him were these and I grabbed these because they do have a drawstring so I can bring them in as much as I would like but also 
it has the um, little button here where you can bring in the waist as well. So these fit him perfect and these were $19.99. Now in this bag is everything I picked up for myself. I am, like I said, going to go back to H&M to exchange two things for a different size for the kids. But when I went, I also um, picked out some jewelry, which I'm really upset the girl didn't put in the bag. She didn't charge me for it because I didn't, I looked at the receipt and there was nothing on the receipt. But I think I had like four pairs of really cute earrings, like three necklaces, some rings, scrunchies for me and Madison. And then I also had one of my pair of leggings. And I don't know how she did not see it in my pile, but all that wasn't in the bag. I did double check the receipt. It was on the receipt. So I might end up going back and picking up more. If I pick up a good amount of things, maybe I'll hop on in the end of this video and show you guys everything else I picked up. Um, Because like I said, I do need to go back and I really want that jewelry. But Anyways, I'll show you guys what I got for myself. So from H&M, I think I only got two things for myself. So I just got these simple pair of leggings. And I feel like these leggings are different from the previous years. I don't remember them having like this thick band up here. And also they're much more high-waisted. I feel like all the other leggings I bought from H&M, or maybe it was from Forever 21, I don't know. But I feel like they weren't high-waisted. These are high-waisted, so I really like that. And these were $9.99. And I did have a second pair but it wasn't in the bag. So I'll probably go back and get another pair. And then I also grabbed this, or actually my husband picked this out. He said he liked it, so I bought it. Um, it's just a pullover sweater. It's really, really soft. And this was $24.99. So grabbed that sweater. And I thought that would go really cute with jeans or leggings. And then from BB, I only picked up two items. So again, my husband, I don't know, he was just picking out clothes for me and he picked out this um, jean jacket, which sucks. You guys are not gonna be able to see it good in the lighting, but it's just a white jean jacket. It was originally 60, but it was on sale, I think for like half off. So I think we got it for like 30, um, but it's just a simple white jean jacket. I got a regular jean color jacket not long ago, but the white one's really cute. You guys will probably see me wearing it a lot. The only other thing I got from BB was this shirt, which sucks i the hanger said um a large i wanted it two sizes bigger because i wanted to wear it with leggings but the shirt is actually a small so there's no way i can wear this with leggings because it's way too short i'll just wear it with jeans but my plan was to wear it with leggings but it's still cute with like a jean um button up and the sleeves are rolled up but you can unbutton it and then it can be a long sleeve but that's the last thing i got from bb and then I only got one, two, four things from Under Armour. Two of them are sports bras. So I got this simple white sports bra and they were having a sale as well. So this was originally 30, but I think it was like $10 off maybe, but I just got a simple white sports bra and then I got the same exact sports bra, but in black, looks like that. And then I got this workout like tank top and this is how it looks it's like a grayish blue color i don't know how to explain it and then if you guys can see it has like the under armor logo with like a lime green that's how it looks and then the back is like crisscross again you guys can't see because of my lighting but this was on clearance for twenty dollars so i just grabbed that and then the last item i got was some leggings and for some reason i thought these were full length leggings but they're not they go past my a little bit past my knee um but that's fine and they're just like a really dark army green color and then it has lime green where it says under armor on the side and they are high waist so that's the last item that i picked up for myself so i hope you guys enjoyed this haul like i said um i do need to go back to h m because I need to exchange two things so if i do pick up a decent amount of items where i feel like you guys might want to see then i will include it at the end of this haul so you guys can see what other new things that I decided to pick up. Also, I apologize. I just realized I'm doing laundry and I'm sitting like right in front of the laundry room. So you guys probably heard the entire time my loud um, washer. So I apologize about that, but I'll probably hop back on in a few days and show you guys what else I got from H&M. All right guys, so I am back. It is actually a few days later and I finally had the chance to run back to H&M and exchange um, the kids clothes. So Madison's shirt i just literally exchanged it for a, a bigger size 
And then for Ryan, I exchanged his pants. Um, I couldn't find those exact pants that I bought the green ones in a smaller size. They either had um, like baby sizes or it was just way too big. So I grabbed him another pair of jeans for the even exchange. And these are a skinny fit and they are just some jeans and they are the skinny look. And these do have also the little cinching in um, the corner there. So these are hopefully fit him. I'm going to try to put a belt on him because I'm tired of going back to return things. And while I was looking around, I found these pants and I know Robert's probably going to laugh, but I don't know. I thought they were cute. They're super, super soft and cozy and it was on clearance for $8.99. So I grabbed it for him. They do have drawstrings so I can bring it in to try to make it fit him a little bit better. But I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's like a very, very dark blue color. And, and then in the bottom, it's like cinched like that or scrunched. I don't know how you would call that, but... Um, yeah, that's how it looks. It doesn't, doesn't have any pockets um, in the back, but it does have pockets in the front and then it is cinched. So that is the second pair of pants that I got for him just because I saw them for $8.99. I only found one of the necklaces that I wanted. For some reason, this H&M didn't have the same jewelry as the other H&M I went to. I don't know. I, at least I couldn't find it. So I just grabbed the necklace that I was supposed to get from the other one that wasn't in my bag. And it's this gold um, double necklace. It was only $7.99. So that's how it looks it has like a little moon in the bottom i thought was really cute so i grabbed this necklace i did pick myself up a pair of jeans i don't know if these are going to fit me because the fitting rooms are closed so i couldn't try anything on but these are these were 20 dollars, and they are curvy jeggings and they are high-waisted and it's just like a light wash pair of jeans and then it does have a little bit of distressing wear i thought it, yeah has distressing right there in the corner just a little bit not anything too crazy and then I just liked the bottom of the pants. So that's the main reason why I got it. And also because I feel like I don't have too many jeans this light and then it has pockets in the back. So hopefully it fits me. If not, I'll have to bring them back, but this is the last thing that I got. So those jeans are the last thing that I purchased from H&M. I thought I was gonna buy more, but honestly one, I was on a time crunch, so I really didn't have time to really like browse around, but I was happy at least I was able to find one of my necklaces and then I'm hoping those jeans fit me. But this is going to end my H&M haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Since the holidays are coming up, you guys are going to start seeing a lot more like shopping videos and hauls. So I really hope you guys enjoy these types of videos because you'll definitely see them a lot more here on my channel, at least for the holidays. And then once the holidays um, are over, then I'll probably go back to majority like cleaning and organizing and stuff like that. But since the holidays are coming around, I think it's really fun to show you guys um, what is out in stores and what I'm getting for my family and friends for Christmas. So hope you guys enjoyed this haul. If you did, please remember to give my video a thumbs up. Also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you haven't already. I would love for you to be a part of my YouTube family. Love you guys. Stay safe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.